fire lighting session. Uh, what day is this? Hmm, is it the 25th? Look at that. Hmm, <coughs> it's wonderful. Uh, we've got kindling, a bit of fire lighter, some tissue paper. Tissue paper, yeah. What do you mean tissue paper? Tissue paper, yeah, paper tissue. Uh, just one bit of fire lighter and it's going. Bits of uh, kindling, waste wood, a couple of bits of waste wood, pine, some kind of pine stuff. And uh, we've got uh, Chamfler Estates, uh, that type of wood there. That stuff's brilliant. See that, um, this stuff, this stuff's fantastic. This, what a heat you got off that. These, you get some heat off them. I like biomass sort of thing. So isn't it incredible how, how, how we're being lied to and deceived by by the government. So it's it's just pure not our spin. Tony Blair would be proud of it. Well he is still involved with that shit, isn't he? That lying bastard. That's probably the root of our problems actually. That he was he was never locked up for what he did. Maybe that if that had happened then we might have had a bit of better behaviour in public figures. So basically I was watching Richard Forbes yesterday talking about the battery storage. Battery storage facilities. Well it's called BESS. B-E-S-S. -S, forget why. It's actually horrifying and they've got planning and to do one on the other side of Cowie. But no, they'd rather moan about West Fraser by some little uh, small amounts of lead that the court said wasn't there. They'd rather go on about that because they'd you know, that's not a danger, but a battery storage facility getting built on the other side of Cowie is. There's got one getting built at Concarden, definitely. And total waste of time. It, it doesn't produce energy, it just stores it. It's completely crazy. What a waste of money. Absolutely insane. And uh, and, and we're and all these numpties are supporting this. And the people getting rich off it. And guess who's got to pay for it? Us. We've got to pay for it. And they want to make like what I'm doing here. They make that they want to make that illegal. The idiots. But we've got to rely on some fucking weird system that's not going to be reliable, just so they can get rich. I'm not allowed to go and cut a couple of bits of wood. You get fucking idiots phoning up the council because somebody's got a fire on. They phone up the police when somebody parts their car on a pavement. It's happened to our country. It's fucked. It's totally fucked. Absolutely. Um. I don't know how they, I don't know if we've got any questions coming up. Have a look at Oh dear, I'm going to have to reboot my computer because the power went off. And that's because uh, there's something wrong with the garage. And when you press the light switch or something wrong, then it causes a causes the trip the cable to trip. So this is a fire lighting session. It looks like it's going. Uh, look at that. That's it, really. Can I do a channel update now? Because I need to go and reboot the computer, which is... Uh, I have to undo the new do that at the back of it. Oh, am I sounding like I don't know what I'm talking about? Well, that's because I don't. <laughs> so, um, thanks for watching. Bye. It's going like a house on fire. 
Wow, look at that, that's wonderful. Just before we go, look at that. How does that look like that? That looks good, doesn't it? With the light shining on it. Thanks for watching. Bye. I mean it this time. I'm going.